Hey you guys and ghouls, it's Ray Blackmoon here, and today I'm going to be playing Stardew Valley. So let's get started. Hi you guys and ghouls, it's Ray Blackmoon here, although I bet you you already heard that from the intro. <laughs> anyway, so as I said in the previous video, I'm going to start the first day in this episode. So, first of all, oop, didn't mean to do that. I meant to do this. There. Cozy fire. And second of all, I'm gonna put that. Actually, no. I wanna put it there. Okay. Uh, how do I. There we go. Yeah. There we go. I better pick this up. Oh. Okay, there. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I got parsnips. Hey. Or oh, here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Oh, thank you, Mayor Lewis. I just realized something else I need to do. I need to move some stuff around. Okay, so. I'm gonna temporarily put my scythe there. I'm gonna put this here, this here, and then this here. Perfect. Alright. Now I can put my scythe. Okay. Oops. Eh. I guess we could put it here. Be interesting. <laughs> okay, weather. What's the weather gonna be like tomorrow? Sunny day! Aw, I want a rainy day. I don't want to work. Oh, wrong button again. Okay, fortune tower, what do you got? Ah, I s- Oh, I should have read the other one. <laughs> ah, I sense that a new visitor has joined us. A young lady from Stardew Valley? Welcome, welcome. The spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Luck will not- be on your side. You know what? I don't like it there. Let's just move it there. And oh. we're gonna move this here. Actually, yeah, I'm not gonna be doing this the whole time. I'm just, I kind of like to have things set up in a certain way. All right. Oh, actually, we should move this over so I can straight away, whoops, go and, you know, uh, there. Okay, enough moving around. <laughs> okay, so the other one said, Welcome to Something Station 5, your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. That was basically it. And the, oh. <laughs> I keep doing that. Okay. Living off the land. Welcome to living off the land. You're back again. Or we're back again. With another tip for y'all. Now listen up. This one's for all you greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forage to earn some cash while waiting on your first harvest. That's a good tip right there. All right, we're done. Let's get in here. Oh boy. We gotta clear this stuff and we gotta be quick because I want to get these plants down as soon as possible. All right, so we're gonna clear out enough space for the plants and also to make sure stuff doesn't get too close to it because I'm not gonna make a fence or anything around it. I probably should, but I, I I gotta save energy and time, so we're just gonna do this as quick as possible. There we go. Oh, I better do it on this side, actually. It A nice tip here, depending on which side you cut the tree, now it's random if you cut here. But, if you cut here, the tree will fall this way. Cut here, and it will fall that way. 
little tidbit if you don't want to lose your stuff because if I let it fall over there that stuff will be out of bounds and then I can't get all of it so that's why I'm cutting this way all right we're almost done here we just got this tree to cut and then we got all the the stone to get rid of There we go. Oh, I should probably get rid of more of this. I just want to make sure. Alright, and let's get rid of that. There we go. Okay. Alright, now for the stone. Hey, I got some coal. That's nice. Alright. I just want to remove just a bit more. Alright, I think we have enough space here. Now... Uh, how do I open my inventory again? Oh yeah, it's E. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna make me a chest so I can store all this. We're gonna put the chest right here. There we go. And we're gonna stick some of this stuff in here. And I'm going to sell one of these. That way I can have my intro to say goodbye, you know. Alright, then we're gonna do that. And now we're gonna go plant these down. Now, here's another little trick for beginners. To avoid having a crow or any bird eat your seeds, I found a way for you to plant down seeds and not need a scarecrow. So... Um, let's make sure we're in the center here and a little bit away from the thing. Okay, we're gonna take our hoe, we're gonna do this, and then right across from there, we're gonna do this. And it's gonna make a, a face. Okay, uh, right here, and then there, there, there. And there we go! A smiley face! Okay, now to plant our seeds. And this will be enough for all these seeds here. It will be 15. And there we go. Now we just gotta water them. No, I might be wrong and this might not work, but as far as I can tell, I never had a bird come and eat my seeds as long as I had it in this formation. So, that's just my experience. It might end up happening to you. In which case, never mind about the tip. <laughs> There we go, we're all set up. Let's put this away for now. And now we're gonna go... Uh... I don't really feel like going into town today. I'm just gonna go check the bus station. See if I can find some forageables. Hey! Here's a flower. Ooh, here's another one. Alright. Eh, I'll go into town tomorrow. <laughs> oh, I should quickly mention, I don't think I mentioned it in the previous video, but... Oh, I need to clear a path. Anyway, um, I am going to be having these videos be one day long. So each episode is going to be of a day. And that's it.
note, um, that might depend also on a few things. Like if I do an ev like if I go to one of the events that happen, then I might make the video a little bit longer because of that. Anyway, let's go check. Ooh, horseradish. There we go. I gotta make enough money to get a backpack upgrade because if we go into my inventory. Right here, this is all I have for space. When I get backpacks, I have to buy them. I will get at least another row of inventory. And then there will be one more backpack I can buy and then I can get all of this. Oh, and by the way, when you're in your inventory or in any of this, it will pause your game. Pretty much any of these um, UIs will pause the game. And you can tell by this flashing. When it's flashing, that means the game is paused. Ooh! Spring onion! I can use that for food! Speaking of which, let's move some stuff around. There. Now I got my food. Nothing over here. Nothing over there. Oh, there is this. Nope, nothing over here. I can be out just a bit longer even though it's getting late. But then I have to head to home. Preferably before even 12. Oh, uh, here's a... Here's a house. It's abandoned. It looks like there's even like a... Garage. How in the world did they have a garage when there's no path or anything for a car? That doesn't make sense. Maybe it's not a garage, it's something else, but... It looks like a garage to me. Ooh. Hey, I got another uh, forgeable. Oh. Eh, I need to get through. Hey, there's something over here. Oh, it's a tower. Oh, it's locked, but uh, but you can hear someone inside though. Hmm. All right, let's go up this way. Oh, this spot right here is where the merchant shows up, but she only shows up on Fridays and Sundays. So she's not there right now because it's Monday. Oh, I should probably... Look at my quests here. I got two new quests. I got getting started, harvest some parsnips, and introduce myself. I've introduced myself to two people, which is Mayor Lewis and Robin. And let's see here. This is my skills and where I can have items that do special things and unlock special things. And here's where all my relationships, people I've met, give gifts to, conversated with, certain amount of hearts I've had with, all of them are here. And there is a lot of people. There's more, but they're not showing. So I have to introduce myself to the rest of these people. And then here's the map. And then crafting thing which you've already seen and this is collecting thing if i collect everything i'll have i'll have um well all my collections done and this is for you know all of this stuff and that's to exit the game which not doing right now all right let's go Yeah. 
All right, let's go this way. I'm gonna have to make a better path for sure. But this works for now. All right, I'm gonna drop some of my stuff off. I'm gonna keep a certain amount of these. All right, and this is the reason why I moved the bed over here, is so it's quicker to get into bed. All right, so we've done day one, and I think I'm gonna call it there, you guys. Eh, I got two gold from this. Eh, not very much. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!